Hello, my dear subscribers and guests of the channel. My name is Jenny. You are on my channel Happiness is Within, where you can find answers to almost any questions. Not almost. Now you can find answers to any questions because I have thousands of videos with the suggestions, with the tips. Where And if you have a question, you choose a video. If it's in English, it's good. If it's not, you can choose to watch it with closed captioning. And closed captioning will give you the English translation. Today, uh, with the help with artificial intelligence, you can even watch video not with the closed captioning. You can watch it and it's gonna simultaneously translate video in English. I don't remember which browser does it. I know that Yandex for sure. And uh, I think Chrome does it too. So check it out and uh, you can uh, turn on that service and you will be able to watch video in any language with the translation to English. And uh, uh, there is a lot of practices and meditations that can help you uh, to get changes in your life, to change you, the perspectives, the way you look at the situations, at people, and so on, you can change what's happening in your life because we are what we are thinking. Our thoughts are what is uh, describing what's happening to us, our concentration. Yes, each of us has our own beliefs, each of us have our, or our own thoughts uh, and uh, our own perspectives, how we look at the situation. That's why I always say there is no right or wrong. Whatever is right for me might be completely wrong for you. And it doesn't mean that it's bad or it's good. It's the way we see it. Whatever is happening to you depends on the way you see it. If you see it as a positive situation, it is a positive situation. If you see it as a negative situation, it is a negative situation in your eyes. And uh, only if you want to change your perspective, you can do it. Otherwise, no one can change it. So today... Uh, we are going to look at subconscious fears. You, as all of us know, fears are not helping uh, live our lives. Our fears are giving us the, you know, the stop. We don't uh, do things that we are feared. The stuff that we have a fear about, we don't do it. And you know what, it can go from the simple thing like I say that I'm afraid of the deep waters. And uh, even though I love ocean, I love sea, I love lakes, but when I go into the water, I am always conscious and I cannot relax because I'm scared that I'm going to step into the very deep end. And this is one of my fears. Uh, I know that to, I have to work on this. And to work on this, I have to start taking swimming lessons. I know what to do. I'm conscious about my fear. You know, but uh, sometimes uh, our fears, uh, fears are subconscious. And we don't realize that... Uh, why we cannot do this or that sure because we don't know what we are scared of so today we are going to try with the deck uh, of Nicoletta Ciccoli and uh, she uh, created her decks she has a oracle and she has a tarot deck they were created to work on people's fears Yes, when I do the personal consultation, I always check, with, do it with the 
one of the practices I do it with the Nicoletta Ciccoli decks that we figure out with the symbols and the feelings from the card what is the person scared about uh, of sorry what is the person scared of I'm sorry when I try to speak fast it uh, always comes to that I don't use the words right bear with me so today uh, for, I'm gonna try to explain to you what you are scared of what is your fear subconscious fear and with help of Nicoletta Ciccoli Depp. So now, as usual, concentrate on your precious selves. Give yourself a compliment and obviously smile. Remember, smile gives your life a better quality and more you smile more things to smile about you get from the universe, uh, God, cosmos, whatever you believe in. So it's going to be three positions and each we are going to see what the deck is going to show us, which fears you have and you can watch all three each position is going to have the tips how to get through and get rid of the fear so maybe it's better to watch the whole video to see all to hear all the tips i'm gonna give during the spread so i hope you are smiling let's start and the first thing that uh, i can say you are scared about, you are scared about the people not accepting you the way, the way you are. Uh, sometimes you hear or maybe you think you hear the phrases like uh, she is not good here, she is not good there. Actually this fear could come from the childhood and obviously today you uh, even if you don't do it consciously subconsciously you keep the distance from the strong feelings you keep the distance from the big changes you are scared that you are not good enough to accept this or this it might be a uh, higher education it might be the higher position at the place where you work and at the same time this fear uh, is not letting you to change stuff is not letting you to make your life the way you want to see it but it's subconsciously and to get it out you have to accept yourself first thing i can tell you accept yourself the way you are second thing priorities prioritize people prioritize situations and don't forget that you are number one priority in your life so don't and don't let people get into you you know we uh, sometimes uh, let people get into our skin it's like uh, hypothetically speaking and uh, whatever people say we tend to believe in it especially when they reject something in us try not to listen to people's uh, people opinion can concerning yourself remember you are unique you shouldn't be the best there is no such a thing the best or the worst everything is the way we see them but realize that you are unique and don't tell uh, don't let other people put you down let's see next fear 
you know, this fear has uh, about 95% uh, of the population, especially in the modern world, when we are susceptible to mass media, to uh, like YouTube, same thing, because we hear a lot of controversial things and it's really ha uh, hard to find a balance and what to accept and what not to accept. Obviously, only you can do it. You are responsible for your life. Remember that. So let's see the second fear. You know, this is the fear of success. I can tell you right away. And sometimes it's not only fear of success. It's a fear when you're going to achieve that success, how to hold on to that. Yes, it's easier to achieve the success than to hold on to that. And uh, your fear of holding on to success sometimes is not letting you come to the heights that you could. Remember that. And uh, the thing is, not to have fear of holding the success, the best thing is to do is always move always do something and always believe in yourself it's uh, you know there is a fear of uh, big money too you know when I was uh, doing my courses of self-development and one of the themes in the course was relationship with money and I was very surprised when I found out that I'm scared of big money. That's why the universe wouldn't let me even come close to making big money. If I would start making on one side, I would lose something on another. And it was all in me, in my subconscious. Remember that. So, to get rid of this fear of success, fear of the... Actually, it could be the uh, fear of heights, too. I, I had it, too, before. I was scared of flying because I was too high in the air. Now, uh, I already went through the getting rid of that fear, and uh, I fly more or less comfortably, and I even love when I take off, when I see how the land is further and further and further and it's like amazing feeling so some of you yes could be afraid of heights too and maybe you don't uh, let yourself uh, accept it so the heights might be virtual or the physical heights and uh, here the bright as I can see this is a fear of success you know you can get rid of that fear by thinking of how you feel when you are on the height of the success how you are happy with whatever is happening to you how you are happy with the changing of your financial situation how you are happy of changing of your status that you are higher that you can do stuff concentrate on that and you will be able to get rid of the fear of success and the third one let's see your greatest fear subconscious fear not conscious fear you know you are scared to open up you are scared scared to show your true feelings you are always hold on to uh, your face you can say you know each of us has a face obviously but i'm not talking about the physical face i'm talking about the mimics and uh, check around and you will see that uh, most of the time each of the people around you have their own face that they are holding on to you are the same like everyone else but your face and your 
inside feelings are uh, you try to keep it always in control you don't let to yourself to be emotional to any level and it could happen from the childhood when uh, you uh, for example were crying and instead of trying to help you to stop crying to talk, calm down parents were like screaming that why are you crying that's right you are wrong and you are guilty listen i'm not trying to make our parents guilty of something they were bringing us up the way they thought it's the best so we cannot uh, be, be mad at them and we cannot uh, be irritated with them it was yes today in today's modern world when we figured out that uh, the trauma from the childhood sometimes doesn't let us live the full and happy life but the good thing is that we can get rid of it so uh, never try to put the guilt for whatever is happened to you to somebody else so and another thing you were the one who attracted all of it even in your childhood this is can be the long explanation of why what where when and this is another spread but in this spread i, I can see that you are scared scared to get out of your cage hypothetically speaking you built subconscious cage for you and you stay there you uh, are scared to get out of it because you are scared to be hurt and this fear doesn't let you build a normal relationship sometimes this fear doesn't let you to express yourself in what you love to do in your life so think about that you can get rid of it even like imaginary cage you can just break it and get set yourself free the main secret the main tip in this on this part in this fear is to set yourself free and get your inside freedom to do anything and to do everything and it's all in your possibility it's you it is possible you can do it and in the end of the spread i just want to wish you to be free of all the fears and live a happy and life in freedom inside you it's a first